Well, this is one of those circumstances in relation to domestic violence where uh, we want to work um, shoulder to shoulder with the government. Uh, the Prime Minister obviously has had some serious allegations made against him. Uh, he's been called a liar and his word questioned. I, I think that needs to be addressed. I think the Prime Minister needs to apologise uh, if he has lied. And I think that issue needs to be cleared up so that it's not a distraction for uh, what is really required here, and that is national leadership uh, to address a national scourge. Uh, we can't allow a situation uh, where women feel unsafe in our community. Uh, as a policeman uh, a long time ago, but uh, all of those images, uh, kids screaming, bloody scenes, uh, it stays with you. And those domestic incidents are not acceptable in any society and certainly not in ours. Uh, there's clearly a need for more funding in the programs that are working a diversion of the money away from the programs that aren't working into the ones that are. The bail laws are woefully inadequate, to, depending on what jurisdiction we're in, uh, and the Prime Minister needs to show the national leadership here uh, to look at the innovation and the way in which we can provide support to families. Uh, the level of violent content that young kids are uh, reading about uh, or viewing online, uh, as we know, our kids, our grandkids are watching a lot on the internet, uh, on YouTube, on Instagram, on TikTok, uh, and there's a level of culpability here from uh, the media companies as well because uh, they're the conveyors uh, of some of these images. Uh, the normalisation uh, of conduct which is not acceptable uh, in the real world and yet some of these young boys, uh, young men, uh, will, will act that out uh, in the real life and uh, there's so many elements to it. Uh, and I think the Prime Minister needs to deal with this very serious allegation that's been made against him uh, about whether um, he's lied again, and that's something that he needs to address. And I think dealing with that distraction is important so that uh, he can get onto the main game of leading our country uh, in a very important area that requires his immediate attention.